Hey, it's Arrow. Inside the rbeats.com studio, rbeatz.com. It's time for the Rock Report. Oh, no, it's not a solo album. It wouldn't happen without the collaboration that Derek and I have. Brad Whitford, you know him from Aerosmith. Well, he's got an incredible new project with Derek St. Holmes. Oh, Derek and I, you know, we've been friends for ever since we met in the mid-70s. You know, we ended up moving to just outside of Nashville and back to the neighbors. And, and the result of the songwriting and the album and... Everything else that's the follow. There is such a great mix of lyrics as well as every instrument that's involved on this album. And and is it is it the experiences that you guys have had as individuals coming together as one, or is it something that you've always wanted to do along the way? Well, um, I've always wanted to do uh, to record like this, which is essentially uh, a live performance. Um, it's kind of how Aerosmith made their Rocks album back when there were only 16 track machines and we were very limited to what we could do tricks and stuff that you know would be impossible peeps now in the recording studio so we recorded this band straight up and live and there's a different energy to it some people don't know what it is because they're so used to hearing you know folks music but live music has a certain feel and and um and a certain kind of energy to it. Brad Whitford from Aerosmith and Whitford St. Holmes. You can get more of this conversation with Brad on rbeats.com, R-B-E-A-T-Z.com, iHeartRadio, Spreaker, SoundCloud, or on Facebook. That's your Rock Report for Friday, June 24th.